Hello, in this video, I'm going to show you how to add subtitle to movies you downloaded from movie box or from other movie streaming platform. So the first one is going to be how to add subtitle to movie from movie box. And the second is going to be how to add subtitle to movie from other sources. So go locate your, your file explorer and then we'll go to movie box folder and we'll go to the movie these are the movies that i have downloaded on my phone already if you don't know how i got to this location you can just check my other channel on how to access your movie box download folder so this is the movie i have on my phone you can see there is no subtitle there at all so i'm going to go ahead and add subtitle to this movie this movie was downloaded on movie box but it doesn't have a subtitle on it so I'm going to go ahead, add subtitle to it. Alright, so to add subtitle to it, what I'm going to do is to ensure that my movie file is um, copied in a separate folder. It has to be on a folder of its own. And the SRT file, which is a subtitle file too, has to be in the same folder. So I've copied my movie. I'm going to create a folder for my movie. So let's create a folder for this movie. I'll go to new folder. And the name of this movie is, um, let's give it Kado Lake. Kado Lake is the name of the movie. So I'm going to create a folder and then I'll go ahead and paste the movie inside the folder. So now that you've pasted it inside the folder, the next thing we're going to do is to go ahead and copy our SRT file, which is a subtitle file from Moviebox folder. Remember, all of this has to be in the same folder for you to work. But your movie file and the subtitle file has to be in the same folder. So we'll go back to our movie box folder and then we'll go to download and we'll go to subtitle here is subtitle so i'm going to look for the movie Cado lake you can see there is already a subtitle file for Cado lake so i'm going to copy it and put it inside the same folder anytime you download movie on movie box it download it together with the subtitle file but the reason why the subtitle doesn't show most time is because you didn't copy the movie and the subtitle file into the same folder. So I'm going to copy the movie file and the subtitle file into the same folder now. So let's go to our folder we created before that had our movie in it. So that is it, Cado Lake. I'll go ahead and paste my CRT file there, which is a subtitle file. Now, what you want to do is to ensure that the name of the movie and the name of the subtitle file is the same. They have to be the same for it to work if not your subtitle will not show on the movie so what i'm going to do is to rename both file to be one apart from the extension file which is .mp4.srt i'm not going to touch those ones so let's start with this so i have Cado lake english i'm going to copy this Cado lake english i'm not going to copy .srt file be careful don't copy .srt file if you do, it is not going to work. So click OK. So come over here. No, I'm going to rename this movie. I'll just paste it there. So, so you can see that Cado Lake English dot MP4, Cado Lake English dot SRT. So the only difference between both of the file is just the extension, which is dot MP4 and dot SRT. All right, do not touch the extension file, no matter what. If you do, your movie is not going to work. So let's play this movie and see what we've done. So initially, this movie had no subtitle, but let's check. You can see that the subtitle is now showing on the movie. So that is it. Now, stay tuned. I want to show you how to add subtitle to movie you downloaded from other strip with, uh, movie streaming platform like FX Movie and... Um, other um, websites that you download movies from. I'll show you how to add subtitle to it if it doesn't have a subtitle already. All right, step two, how to add subtitle to movies you downloaded from other sources. 
all right so we'll go to our download folder we'll locate the movie so this is the movie we downloaded from other sources it's called taxi driver so i'm going to play the movie so that you see that there is no subtitle there so let's scroll you can see there is no subtitle at all it's just plain movie so we'll go ahead and add subtitle to this movie just like we did in the first step you're going to copy the movie into a folder of its own and the folder and the SRT file has to be the same. So I will go ahead now and download SRT file. So let's go to our browser and we type the name of the movie that we want. So the name of this movie is Taxi Driver. So I'm going to type Taxi Driver subtitle English download because i want the subtitle to be in english language if you want yours to be in another language like french or arabic or any other language that you might have chinese you just change it subtitle french if you want it to be in french subtitle arabic if you want it to be in arabic So that is what you do. So you go ahead. Mine is English, so I'll leave it as English. I'll open my file. I'm going to download from subtitle C80. Subtitle C80 have subtitle file for a whole lot of languages that you, you know, a whole lot of language. So use it. Subtitle C80 is a good platform to download subtitle for your movies. So I'm going to scroll down to my own language, which is English. Here's English here. I'm going to click it and then it's asking me to download. I'm going to go ahead and download this. So I'll ensure that it's a CRT file. I will download it. So I'll just ignore this. This is an ad. So um, we'll go to our download folder now and see. So on our download folder here, you will notice that we have taxi driver there. You can see that folder there, Taxi Driver. So I'm going to copy our movie file, which is Taxi Driver, and I'm going to cop paste it inside. I'm going to paste it inside Taxi Driver CRT folder. All right, so we have Taxi Driver CRT, Taxi Driver MP4. So what we're going to do is to rename both file as one. Both file has to bear the same name so I'm going to go ahead and copy this name here. Apart from the .srt, I'll come over here. No, nope. I'll come over here and then rename. I'll paste the name there. Notice that I did not copy the file extensions like .srt or .mp4. The only thing I change is just the name. So you leave out .srt or .mp4. So when that is done, you have been able to add subtitle to your movie remember you should not change the file extension what i mean by the file extension is those last um, three letters dot srt or dot mp4 so let's go ahead and play this movie and see that this is working the way it ought to work so we'll play the movie All right, you can see that it is now showing a subtitle to, to the movie. Thank you for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you some other time.